Hey guys, welcome back to the channel once again. And this video is about how can you have two different operating system on a single device. And the first one, obviously, which is running natively with this device. So yeah, we are going to have that. But before that, sorry for making this video so late because uh, I was busy at work. So there was plenty of office work. So I had to do. So I've got time right now. And here we are. So the first thing, as you know, uh, obviously, the device comes with a uh, basic android like whatever the latest version it runs with so this is the redmi note 7 pro the old guy and uh, it runs on android version 10 qk whatever the package is and with the miui version 12 so uh you don't have to install any twrp or you don't have to root this device to have other extra operating system yeah you heard me right so all you just have to go to the play store and you have to download an application called virtual box yeah you heard me right because uh, as you guys know uh, like windows or any other thing in term of emulation you need an emulator to run different version of operating system or a virtual environment so the same goes with this device we are just going to install this uh, application called virtual android it is going to allow us to have a different emulator within this device so make sure your device is compatible like it would be quite compatible if your device is uh if your device cost more than like ten thousand rupees so, so that would have minimum requirements i guess so uh try uh, it would worth the try so as you can see i have installed the application it's quite uh, like uh, 600 mb in size and you can see the boot logo which basically uh android device has so here we are so as you can see the interface is quite minimal and simple just like a stock basic android so you can do plenty of things so let's jump into the notification toggles you can see it has a different like a way beyond different from the miui 12 and i can simultaneously access both the environment like the real one the android 10 and as well as with the android 7.1 within this virtual box so if i jump into the setting you can go down you can check the android version it runs with android 7.1 so now you guys know very well what you guys can do what you can do what it is capable of doing and what you can have you guys know uh, like 7.1 doesn't have that much restrictions you can record netflix and so many other things and uh, that wouldn't bother you that much so I can access both the environment you can see there isn't that much lag or anything so uh, if your device runs with um, 3 or 4 GB of RAM that would be enough for having two environments continuously and you can immediately import the application if you have running on the device you can import the package directly and install it for example I can have any any but there's a limitation like uh, the certificate the certified application which uh, needs to be installed wouldn't install in this because uh, that wouldn't work uh, that is because it doesn't allow you to access the uh, network information network information in the sense the uh, imsi the cellular data info okay so you can't have like application upi and all so you can install other applications like instagram whatsapp and tamp email and so many other things you guys know what to do netflix and all you can install it there isn't any restriction and you can access both the environment you can see you guys can do plenty of things now the environment is unlocked you can do whatever you want so i thought uh, it would worth to share this video so here i am sharing this with you guys you can import files videos and application whatever you want to do and you want so yeah that's pretty much it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have any questions you can ask me down in the comment section below and uh, let me know what are your thoughts about this app so yeah thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next video have a great day bye bye